Hi, my name is Nathan Dankers. I'm a student at Aviation Maintenance here at WNCC. So my favorite part about being an aviation student out here is you're surrounded by people who are also passionate about aviation. Everyone is passionate about aviation. You know, I'd say, oh yeah, I saw a, a whatever over the weekend flying over. And they think it's just as cool as, as, as I do. Classwork versus shop work. Um, it really depends on where you are in the program. The first semester is a lot of book work and classwork, um, but that's because this program is designed to take people who don't know a thing about aviation and in two years get them to the point where they can go work on all these different systems. And so right now we're in our third semester and we've had you know, only a handful of days that we were entirely in the classroom. Just more often than not, we're out here. So what I would say to someone who's undecided it really depends on what they want to do in aviation. The thing that this school really excels in, general aviation side of things, nose to tail, working on everything. I already have my commercial pilot's license. Uh, my end goal is to be a missionary pilot. In order to do that, you need to also have your mechanic license, have the know-how to say, hey, hey, here's what you need to fly in so I can get this plane out of here. And I mean, right now with aviation, everyone's retiring and no one's getting into it. You will always have more work than you can handle um, and salary is just going to get driven up and up and up. Hi, I'm Joe Julius. I'm an aviation maintenance instructor here at WNCC Aviation in Sydney, Nebraska. And I'm a third generation pilot. I've been a pilot for 14 years now. Been a airframe and power plant mechanic for about eight years, nine years. We're a two-year program. Uh, some of the focus areas in aviation would be like an airframe. Uh, we spend a lot of time in sheet metal, fabricate patches and structural repairs, and spend a lot of time riveting and forming sheet metal. Uh, once I get into power plant, that's more like tearing down engines and rebuilding them. Um, I spend quite a bit of time teaching turbine class, so we go through the fundamentals and principles of how turbine engines operate. And then the general component is mostly classroom mathematics, physics, basic electricity, and then once they complete those sections, they can test out and get their airframe and power plant license. After they complete that in two years, they can go down to the main campus and get an Associates of Applied Science.